The United States Department of Housing and Urban Development publicly announced in March of 2015 the Electronic Appraisal Delivery Portal, or EAD. While very similar to UAD and the UCDP portal that has been in use by Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac for a few years now, there are a few key differences. Specifically, differences in a few key data point requirements, a few new hard stops, and the inclusion of a digital certificate that ensures the XML file being delivered has been created by the appraiser listed and has not been modified or tampered with between the appraiser and HUD. The first thing you must do before you can deliver reports in MISMO XML that are ready for EAD delivery is set up your unique digital certificate. To do this, click on the Edit menu up top and then select Preferences. Next, in the menu area to the left, click on Certificates in the Registration section. We will assume you have previously registered with all of your user information in the appraisal program. If so, click on the pull-down menu for the user and select the user you wish to generate a certificate for. You will need to generate a certificate for each user who will be sending reports through EAD. Once you have selected the user, click on the License pull-down and select the state license for the user you wish to generate a certificate for. If the user is licensed in more than one state, you will need to generate a certificate for each state license. Although there are other options listed, for now you will only need to create a self-signed certificate. Click on this button and your self-signed certificate will be generated. For security reasons and because this certificate is tied to you specifically, you will not want to share this certificate with anyone. You will need to use this exact same signed certificate every time you submit a report to EAD. If you lose it in a move to a new computer or because of damage to your current computer, you will not be able to simply generate a new certificate. You will have to contact HUD FHA and this can be a real pain. To avoid this, you will want to back up your certificate along with your public and private keys. You can do this easily by clicking on each of the export buttons and saving the files to a USB flash drive or to a cloud storage account. There is an export button for the private and public keys, as well as one for your certificate. Whichever way you choose to store this file, just make sure it's somewhere off of this computer. When you are restoring from this backup, you will simply click the import buttons and browse the files in, starting with the public and private keys. Using your digital certificate to sign your MISMO XML for upload to the EAD portal is simple. Go to the Orders menu and select Create MISMO XML. EAD. The delivery process from here is pretty much identical to creating a standard UAD and MISMO XML file. The only key difference is the validation process, which will check and flag any problems found that conflict with EAD specifications. Once you've created your XML file, follow your lender or AMC's instructions for delivering the file. One final note, while you're typing out your report, if you wish to spot check your work against the EAD specifications, use the toolbar icon for Review the Open Report. Once in the validator, you can use the pull-down menu above the Error and Warning panel to select EAD.